What's up, new blood? So if you are watching this video, it's because you are pre pretty new to the Bison Peak team. We wanted to make this quick video to make sure that you had a pretty good understanding of exactly what you were supposed to be doing every day when you show up to the yard. So let's start right at the top. We'll make this as quick as possible. Obviously, it is your job to show up by at least noon. So get to the yard by 12 o'clock, right? As soon as you get to the yard, you want to open up your personal vice and go to ADP. ADP is where you clock in and out for your day as well as take your lunches. It's also where you probably entered your direct deposit information and how you can check your pay stubs. But make sure you clock in on ADP. We don't clock, clock in on deputy. Once you've clocked in, you can go ahead and go to whatever dispatcher is out there in the morning who has all the bags for the vans. You're gonna find the bag that's got your name on it and you're gonna go ahead and get your, find out which van you're at. Once you get to your van, you can start signing into your devices. The first one I want you to look for is the one with the M on the back, right? So both of them will say the van number and then one will have an M. That's your mentor device. You sign into that one because um, you sign into that first because you have to do the inventory of your van. You want to make sure that you do a full walk around on that van and make sure that there isn't any damage that needs to be reported to the dispatcher that's hang hanging out bags that day. Do not for any reason hit thumbs down on any of those line items in your mentor device while you're doing your inventory unless you are otherwise told to buy a dispatcher or manager. Everything else goes green thumbs up, and if you have damage that needs to be reported, you report it to the dispatcher that morning. Do not hit thumbs down. The reason why is because that damage has been reported before, most likely. If it's new damage, come let one of us know, let us confirm it, and we'll tell you what to do. Otherwise, you're double and triple and quadruple reporting the same damage on the same van, and that stuff can get our vans grounded by Amazon, so we wanna make sure that we're avoiding that. Let us know, we'll make sure we do whatever needs to be done for that damage, but please do not hit the thumbs down on any of those things. Once you've done the entire walk around and everything has a thumbs up, everything has a thumbs up, then you scroll to the very bottom of that page and there'll be a blue button that says file report. You have to hit file report. Do not leave the yard without hitting that button, file report. It has to get done before you start moving your van. If you move your van and you haven't filed your report, we immediately get a report from, or an uh, alert from Amazon saying somebody hasn't done their mentor yet and they're driving around your van without this thing being done. Mentor has to be tracking you from the minute you start driving, so please make sure you get that done. Once that's done, you're good to go. What I do want you to do also, now that you're at that point, is go to the very bottom of that page on your mentor screen, and right in the middle at the very bottom will say playlist. And if that button has any red notification bubbles on it, it means you have videos that need to be watched during your training. You have one week from the day that you first drive a van with Amp with Bison Peak to watch all of the videos that Mentor gives you. It's a total of like 15, and I'm not gonna lie to you, it's a lot and it's boring and they're not fun at all, but they have to be done within seven days of the day you started driving with us. So, um, please remember to get those done. You have two choices. You can, at the end of every one of your shifts, stick around, stay on the clock and watch a couple and do like three at a time for five days, boom, get it done and under that seven day period, that'd be awesome. But if you're not working that often and you're getting down to the wire, I will allow you to go ahead and clock in from home. You can download the Mentor app on your personal device and clock in from home and just watch them while you're watching TV. I don't care how much attention you pay to those videos. I just need them done. And some of them are interactive and they require you to ask, you know, answer questions and whatnot. But as long as you get them done, it should take approximately two hours to watch all 14 uh, if you watch the first one on the first day. Um, and it should be quick and easy. So please make sure you get those done. Let us know if you have any problems with that and we'll make sure we help you out. Once you've got done your mentor stuff, you can sign into Flex. Flex, Sometimes we'll have your route already loaded and sometimes it's not there until you get to the until you get to the station. It depends on the day. It's totally Amazon's process. We don't have any real control over that. But get yourself signed in. If your route hasn't already loaded already, no worries. Just let somebody know and we'll probably tell you to be patient. Everything will be fine. If it has loaded, you're going to see a screen that says scan however number many number of packages you have for that day. And then below it, it'll say in the orange bar, swipe to finish. 
That orange bar is like the bar of death right now. You do not want to swipe to finish until you've scanned your packages. What I tell people to do in order to make sure that you don't accidentally do that is as soon as you see the words above that orange bar that say scan a number and packages, hit scan number of packages and don't touch the orange bar at all. And it'll automatically bring you to your scanner screen. You can then just close down your mon your, uh, the screen on your device and it'll allow, it'll then be ready for you to scan when you get over to the station. If it's not there and you have to wait till you get to the station for your route to load, no big deal. But please, if there's anything else that you catch from this video, do not swipe to finish before scanning your packages. You have to scan your packages. Otherwise, our STV or scan to verify metrics go down for this company and it's a big hit. So please don't let that happen. You have to scan all of your packages. Picking up packages at the station is not the same thing. Do not go to the menu button, the little three bars at the top left, and hit pick up to pick up your packages. You have to hit scan packages above that swipe to finish button in order to do this properly. So please don't get it wrong. Once that's all done, awesome, you've got everything done. Um, one other thing that we've added in that we you now need to make sure that you do before you even leave the yard is that every day, especially every day that I'm working, and sometimes on the weekends, depending on how squirrely I'm feeling, you will have a video of the day. This will take place, take the place of the stand-up meeting that we're normally supposed to have, where we would just call everybody out of their vans before we left the yard and have a big meeting with you all standing around so we could have in-person discussions about what needs to be covered. Because that can't happen, we're doing Bison Peak TV. And Bison Peak TV is only found on band and does require that you have to mark yourself attended to prove that you've watched the video. We're also hiding little net, uh, Easter eggs in there like the secret word, um, or just asking you a very specific question about something that we've mentioned in the video in order to confirm that you've watched it. So you have to watch those band videos and you have to mark yourself attended and be ready to answer the question when somebody comes around to check all of your information. Before you leave the yard, we're going to check A, that you clocked in, B, that you did your mentor and it went all the way through, you filed that report, C, that you don't have any videos left on mentor to watch, and just because you're not, just because you finished your first 15 doesn't mean that mentor won't throw in a new one every once in a while. So make sure even after you've been driving with us for a couple of weeks, you're still checking that spot and if the little red notification comes up, you have to hit it. Um, and then we're gonna ask you if you watch the band video, what the secret word is or what the specific question is of the day and whether or not you marked yourself as attended for that video. That's everything that you have to do in order to be able to leave the yard and or the station and properly start your day. So please make sure you guys get all that stuff right. Welcome to the team, we're glad to have you and we will talk to you soon. Make sure you give me a shout or talk to anybody at dispatch if you have any questions. We'll talk to you later.